Hi there, welcome back to the channel. Now today we're going to be making a pizza with uh, sun-dried tomatoes. These actual sun-dried tomatoes which we just got from Sainsbury's are oregano and garlic they've got on them. So yeah, so I thought I would mix that in with some Hain's candied sort of jalapeno. But this is the relish version, uh, so it's a hot relish. And I've got some red onions as well, so we're going to put our sauce on. Margarita. Uh, for the latte, I mean not margarita uh, for the latte tomato sauce and then we'll put our toppings on so and uh, we'll see what it tastes like it's going to be a wee bit spicy but that's okay because we like spicy spicy is good so we've got our sauce on we've got our sauce on next we're going for the cheese Uh -oh. Now with the cheese, I normally, on a pizza, I normally put about 50 grams of cheese roughly. That's just a little tip, because I always wonder when I'm watching other people make pizza, so how do you know how much cheese to put on? So I sort of determined the perfect amount for me, and I reckon it's 50 grams. So if you, you can put more or less if you want, but I just think 50 grams is the, is the optimal amount. That's the word I was looking for, optimal. Word of the day, optimal. Well, double that for me then. Yeah, you can have 100 <laughs> grams of cheese then. 50 is good for no, me. No, you joking. Got to try and keep this bigger somehow, so 50 grams of cheese. Good for me. Right, there we go. Red onions, sun-dried tomatoes. They're quite chunky, these sun-dried tomatoes. Might just give them a wee squeeze as well while I'm at it. You can see all the oil on here as well in this tub, it's quite nice. They look really nice. They look sweet. They smell really nice, actually really nice. So, yeah. Um, why not I put that lid on there? That's the wrong lid. Right, I've got some kitchen towel here. Chef's friend, when you get oil all over your hands. And it, uh, right, what else was I going to put on it? Relish. Relish. Chili relish. Okay, so give it a wee stir. Right, this is very hot, this stuff. Very hot, actually. So, I'm just going to... Pull it, rub bits. it on. Yeah, we'll rub it on, but it is, it's really spicy, so yes. you, you don't need to be... You can be a bit less generous with this stuff. Rather than be generous, be less generous. That's the word for this one. So there we go, it looks nice already, so let's get it in the oven. I just need to move stuff out of the way so that I don't knock it off the table. And then uh, we'll have a wee see what it tastes like. Okay, we ready pizza? Yes. Good. Let's go. Oh, the door's in the way. The door's in the way. Right. And it goes. Let's kick it. Wow, now this is a nice looking pizza. I like the look of this one. I like the look of this one. Yeah, I look good. It smells amazing. So yeah, there we go. Sun-dried tomato with oregano garlic and red onion and some candied jalapeno as well, just to add a bit of spice. So let's give it a try. Okay, we get to try it now. Oh, there's a big bit of jalapeno there, huge. Might avoid that, but... <laughs> Looks absolutely massive. Right, oh, here we go. Mmm, now that is a good pizza. First off, the dough's delicious. Oh, the dough's really nice, extra nice tonight. Don't forget that recipe's on the channel, so you need to try it, you need to try it, it's a brilliant recipe. It's also in the book, so yeah, in the vegetarian pizza oven on Amazon. Uh, so yeah, the dough's lovely. The sun-dried tomato's really nice, really soft, but really sweet. And uh, you're getting a nice crunch of the onion, and also you're getting this spiciness from the jalapeno, which is really nice as well. So you've got all these different flavours just go in your mouth and you're going, ooh, 
I'm gonna eat the nerve bit of that. It's delicious. You need to give that a try. Those those uh, those sun-dried tomatoes are actually really nice. They're sort of in the fresh fridge bit, so they're not so, but processed or anything sitting in a jar, they're actually fresh, so they're really tasty. I really like them. So yeah, give them a try. Uh, find them in the fridge. Red onion, jalapeno. This stuff, I love this hen stuff, it's really nice. You, you get the jalapeno version, you get a barbecue version, which we've got here as well. This is a sort of spicy barbecue version. You get the green jalapenos, the red jalapenos, the relish. Really, you get it on Amazon, really nice again. Love that. So yeah, that's a delicious pizza. So give it a try, like, subscribe, leave a comment. We'll see you next time. Bye.